everyone, Joe here. How are you? So nice to see you guys again. And thank you once again for all of you who constantly message me and asking me how I'm feeling. I really do appreciate it. Um, I'm getting there slowly. I, I'm having more okay days and some not so okay days, but um, I, I think it's getting better. So uh, once again, thank you so much. I do appreciate it. So here we are. I can't believe it. It's um, mid-August already. I don't know where the summer went. And we're all thinking about fall already. And I've been watching um, so many videos. And I'm so inspired by so many people, as always. Liz at Tradition by the Seasons always blows me away. And um, Arlen, I'm watching you with the new the blue and the white and the burnt orange, which is really nice, different. Um, I'm watching Jody at, um, I don't remember the full name of the uh, channel, Southern Traditions, I think maybe. And she does uh, is doing a lot of the Tuscan stuff that I love so much. I'm really enjoying that series. And um, I just watched uh, Kenya, I think is um, your name or her name. Uh, with her autumn tree and she does really beautiful work and she has a beautiful house as well so I'm really really inspired and what's so funny is that uh, you know way before when I was thinking about this in the winter I was thinking I'm gonna do fall this year in a very Tuscan-esque uh, kind of style with the uh, burnt oranges and the burgundies and you know that stuff and not so much that cutesy stuff the scarecrows and the crows and all of that kind of stuff I'm really not going to use I'm probably going to use that in my bay window because that's what people would expect you know from the outside world when they uh, see that kind of stuff so I'm probably going to you know use a lot of my scarecrows and stuff like that in the window but in the house per se I am not going to be doing that I'm not going to be using those uh, tomato bushels that I have or the apple bushels things like that because they're a little bit too 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 uh, country or farmhouse and my house is definitely not a uh, country and it is definitely not a uh, farmhouse it's you know way more traditional so I'm thinking the Tuscan style uh, and it goes along with better with you know how we feel about things and um, I, I think we're gonna enjoy that and I really do like the colors Although I love when people do the glam stuff and I love when people do all the white stuff. I think that's really great. But we're moving into a time when we're not going to have any color over here uh, where I'm from in this part of the country. It's just going to become gray all the time. So, you know, I, I know we're gonna, I, I just want to have a blast of color right now with the oranges and, you know, all those really great colors and smells and, and so on. And... Um, you know, and then of course winter, which is just uh, Christmas, which is over the top. And then right after that, it just kind of gets like really dull. So uh, I am going to use those and I'm going to do, although not pure Tuscan style, I'm going to be doing a Tuscan-esque kind of style. But those videos are go actually going to start during the week. Today, what I what I did was I'm just putting together a bunch of photographs that I have of years past of things that I've done and I'm looking at them like you're going to be looking at them because I don't want to repeat certain things and some things I do want to repeat so by doing this process it'll give me a better handle on the direction that I'm going to take okay everybody so I hope you enjoy this uh, video and um, I'll be talking to you really soon and I have a lot of stuff coming up hopefully thank you all thank you so much